Good morning everyone. I'm here today to show you how I've been doing my little watercolour tags lately. Um, they're quick and easy to do and they're really really fun and uh, I'll show you the ones that I've done so far. So this is my first one that I made and I gave it a plaid background um, in watercolour paint and then watercolour painted the little fox in and then just stamped hello and stuck some sequins on the top. And then the next one that I did, I wanted to get the effect of a tortoise shell cat. So I kind of die cut the cat and then watercolored it and then stuck it onto the tag um, with some sequins and some watercolor paint spatters on the tag. So I'm going to head in. I'm not quite sure what one I'm going to do today, but... Um, Let's get started anyway. I know I want to do another plaid background but in nice colours because I picked up the new distress markers yesterday and I quite fancied doing um, a pinky yellow kind of one with a hint of green. So let's just get started with these. So I'm going to use... Um, Picked raspberry, squeezed lemonade, and evergreen bow. a stamp set from Clearly Bizotti called Many Thanks and there's a cute little stamp set down in the bottom corner here that says I am so thankful for you which will fit in there just perfectly I'll just get a block and pop that on and before I actually stamp that in there I'm going to give it a wash of watercolour I'm so thankful for you with a watercolour background. I quite like that actually. So that's the, the little tags that I've been making lately. That was the last one that I had cut out of watercolour paper. Um, so quick and easy to do and if you fancy making them, they're great fun. So I shall see you later and thanks for watching. Bye for now. <laughs>